Yeah, yeah, and this brings me to a question: Is uh, before we before we into get into the details of few of the terms, is how does like like you said, most of the people this is only some time back that even reviewers rejected this particular idea of focusing on theory of deep learning. So, in in a, in a very bird's view angle, how can you uh, explain that? How does the understanding of theory of these machine learning techniques help us? uh in whatsoever sense be it application related or in general from a developer's perspective or just from a theory like developing much more efficient algorithms if 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 you were to explain me or someone who doesn't know about the theory how do you explain that so first i want to mention that like theory means a broad range of things as long as we really try to understand something whether it's complete phenomenal investigation or like complete theoretical like complete math, mathematical proofs i call these all theory as long as we're really trying to understand what's going on and in the real bird's view if we understand the different pieces of what is making a machine work then we could and what parts are missing then it would make it much easier to make that better um and like have more handles on it in terms of longer context where do you see as in what kind of benefits that you can ideally imagine or dream of while people are working on theory of uh, machine learning techniques what kind of benefits we can as in uh, as the overall community can get like what 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 do you envision this uh, this domain of research to be like right so i think um we have uh, we've been working on showing the community what are the things that are missing and where we are failing so for example we looked into failure modes of out of distribution generalization and out of distribution generalization is essentially what we need because you always train on some data that's going to change some way or the other when you test it so i think we like understanding deep learning essentially helps us see our failure modes and where we're missing but also give us direction like this um work that i mentioned that these are the things that we're missing so let's take a step back and look where we're going and uh, make sure that there, we are we take care of the failure modes but we also improve our methods so uh one example that i have which is one of my favorite papers is that back from back when i started at brain so that was the time that resnets were like really big thing and we and if you wanted to regularize them you had this giant four dimensional tensor and good luck taking a cd on that so there was people would get would get really stuck on that like when people were using gans they wanted to regularize them or they wanted to solve inverse problems and this regularization was something that was missing so with my colleagues we did some mathematical analysis of cnn and because of the shape of shape of convolution function we could actually simplify this to a problem which is essentially two lines of python code and that's it it gives you all the singular values and now you could regularize and even at google's scale it made this made a huge difference of being able to take those spds and regularize versus not doing that and that essentially enabled a lot of follow up works a lot of um places that their people were stuck in improving their models or getting better performance or faster performance that essentially opened the gate to a lot of uh, enabling people to do a lot of follow up work which was really exciting so i think that's another aspect that uh these investigations would essentially help us and also helping us going beyond just pattern recognition and do more reasoning and like can we can we probe first of all how much net network is reasoning and memorize versus memorizing but also can we enable the network to do that can we add these capabilities to our network so, and that's something that i'm really excited about Thank you. Thank you.